it's Mia. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a taste test for Munch Pack. And I'm really excited because I was sent this box for review. And I've watched actually a lot of these on YouTube, so I'm pretty familiar with it. But anyways, let's get to it. Okay, so I just opened the box and it looks like this. Nice. But this card says, this Munch Pack was made just for you by Joseph. So thank you, Joseph, if you're watching this. Okay. But that's what it looks like. And then it just has like um, a free munch pack, so like a contest, I guess. But yeah, let's taste some stuff now. Well, oh, they're wrapping with this cute. Okay, so first it's these Hers Old Bay seasoned potato chips, and they look like that. So, let's see. This is a weird taste for a potato chip. It tastes like steak. I mean, it's good. And I will be rating these um, a one through 10 like I always do for all my taste tests. And I can rate these a good eight, a good eight. That's good. Okay, now we have these Josh Perece. Is that supposed to be Spanish? I have no idea. I think so. But it looks like that. I think this is a Spanish snack because everything is in Spanish. So yeah. Not quite sure yet. Um, I have no idea. I think this is in another language though. Because I cannot read it. I have no idea. I will be right back. I'm gonna try to figure this out. It looks it's pretzels. I know it's pretzels, I just have no idea what kind. But I'll be right back. I'm gonna try to see if it's on the box. I just don't want you guys wait. Okay. So I'm just gonna taste it because I couldn't find where it's from, but. Oh, they're just pretzels. Of course I'll rate these a 10 because they're pretzels. Yeah, these are good. Okay, so now we have potatoes. And if you're from Ireland, you know what I'm talking about. But yeah, these are potato chips, but they're manufactured in Northern Ireland. And I'm guessing potato means potato chip. So if you didn't know that, that's how they say potato chip in Ireland. Interesting, huh? And this is in the flavor salt and vinegar. Just like that. So, let's try it. Even though I probably know I'm gonna like these because I like salt and vinegar, but let's try it. This is what it looks like. I obviously give these a 10, by the way, because they're boss. Moving on. So now we have popping candy in this completely cool bag. Actually, take a moment. This bag is so cool. And I'm guessing from the little anime on the front that it has to be somewhere in Asia. But it says made in China, but I have no idea. But it's really cool. It says boom everywhere. And I'm guessing these are like America's Pop Rocks. Because it says popping candy. And it's in the flavor of cola. So this should be pretty interesting. I'm not sure, but let's go. Uh, I'm scared to eat these. Okay. Okay, yeah, they look like that. They come in like little packages. Okay. Oh, God. Let me pour a little bit in my hand. Okay, let's go. You guys be quiet enough. You could hear this. Wait, why well, am I telling you guys? Okay. I think these um pretty good. About uh, eight point five. These are decent. Good job. I don't know where this is from, but I just totally spilled those on the floor. Okay, but anyways, yeah, these were good. Hey yo. Okay, so now. I have no clue what this says, so I cannot even read the name to you, but it looks like that. So if you guys know what that says, comment down below. That'll help me out a lot. I mean, it looks like a cherry with gel inside. Don't know. And I'm pretty sure this is a product of Japan, from what it says on the back. Um, but yeah, why not try? I'm really scared. I have no idea what this is. I know some of you are going to laugh at me. Oh, 
Okay. I'm going to go for this one. Maybe not that one. I rate that a, a zero. I couldn't even put it in my mouth. That's disgusting. I don't know what that is. So if you guys know what that is, comment down below. And yeah. But also, I wanted to tell you guys one more thing. That I will have Munch Pack's link in the description box below. So make sure you go check them out. Because this is so cool. And it comes to your door every month. So, yeah. It's awesome. Okay. Now we have Loat Koala's March. I'm going to show you the packaging. Guess where it's from. Did you guess yet? You probably guessed it right. It's Australia. I'm pretty sure. I'm thinking. It says part of the Australian Koala Foundation. So pretty sure it's Australia. But these are chocolate cream filled cookies. So that sounds really, really good. But yeah, I'm just going to. I almost destroyed it. Okay. Interesting. Okay, yay. I thought there was something in there, but not. Okay, I'm just gonna try them. I have a feeling these are gonna be really good though. So they just did that with a koala on them. Ooh, the chocolate's really milky. Yum. Um, 10 out of 10 for sure. These are really, really good. Probably my favorite thing so far. Okay, now I have Kiki Plus. Kiki Plus. Okay, I'm guessing this is also from Asia. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm so wrong. It's from Croatia. Sorry, I was really off there. But um, these are toffee. Oh, look, caramela. I think that's how you say it in Croatian. It has like a translation thing on the bottom. So these are just hard candies. Well, they're toffee, but fruit flavored, I guess. So let's try it. My cutting skills are bad. Okay, I'm gonna go for strawberry. Oh yeah, it's like, if you guys like live in the USA, they kind of remind me of now or laters. So, yeah. smell good. Nine out of ten. But yeah, awesome. Good job, Croatia. Okay, now we have this. And I'm referring to it as this because I cannot read this at all. I don't know what language this is either. I have no idea. Let's just try it. I think I opened this one. Oh, God. I'm scared. I can't read it. I don't know what it is. I don't know what type of candy it is. These smell kind of weird. Uh -huh. I'm scared to try this. They're sour. I usually like sour candies, but whoa! Ugh. Mm. Bye. That's about good. Okay, now I have these Dalco, that's how you say it. And I'm guessing they're like cakes. And one is super milk and one is super shook. This not means chocolate, but they just look like that. So from the picture, they kind of look like Twinkies, if you know what that is in America. I'm sure they have Twinkies other places, but in America, it's Twinkies. They smell good. Wait a minute, these remind me of like a honey bun. Just like that. Like 
These are good. Well, this one's good at least. I haven't tried this one. I'm gonna try this one really good. They taste exactly like a Twinkie. And if you've never had a Twinkie, oh, you should go try one. But this is definitely chocolate. It looks like that. Sorry. But let me just try this one. Mm hmm. I was a hundred. Even though that's not in the scale, a hundred. I'm loving these tatoes! <laughs> Yummy. So, you guys already know what time it is, but that was the end of the video. I really love this box. I was really surprised with it. Um, Munch Pack is awesome, so make sure to go get your box. It'll be delivered right to your door with a bunch of great snacks from all around the world. So, I really recommend them. Their link will be down below, right down there. Just look. And... If you guys get one or you're already subscribed, tell me how you like it or tell me what you get in your pack or anything like that. But I know I enjoyed this and thank you so much, Munch Pack, because it was incredible. I love you. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Also, if you could please share this with your friends and family, I would really appreciate it. Also, subscribing. It's free if you want to subscribe. You will get a notification when I post a video. So, yeah. But anyways, I love you guys so, so much, and see you next video. Bye! Okay, and I wanted you guys to know that you guys should really check them out because they're, these glasses are so, like, long-wearing, and just, and they're affordable, like, and I, I'm telling you from my own experiences, I bought so many glasses from them. They're incredible.